Let's get ready for another edition of The Whole Internet Hates Amanda. But today I'm going to talk to you about why you might want to rethink that melatonin gummy for your tall boy. My name is Amanda Jusen. I'm the founder and creator of Baby's Best Sleep. I'm a registered social worker. I'm an evidence-based practice, and I want to share some evidence with you regarding melatonin use and your child. Before I go any further, I want to just stress that if your doctor has recommended melatonin to you, or if you have a neurodivergent child, I'm not speaking to you. There are some indications that melatonin can be very helpful in these populations. Last June, the CDC released findings that melatonin overdoses were up 530% among young children. DM me if you want a copy of this, I can send it to you. What was really interesting about this study is the study found that the single highest increase in melatonin um, uh, being used by children coincided with the COVID-19 pandemic. What does that tell me? That tells me something I already see in my practice, that parents are desperate, and if this natural supplement is supposed to help your children go to bed easier, why wouldn't we use it? Evidence on melatonin use in young children is relatively low, and we don't know the safety and efficacy yet. There's also some suggestion that melatonin use, when supplemented, may not be producing naturally in the child, which may impact their ability to produce melatonin later on. There's also some suggestions that melatonin use can impact puberty and development later on. Some children are using so much melatonin that they're being hospitalized for use. So it comes down to this. If your child is having trouble sleeping, if you're having this many behavioral issues at bedtime, if you're really struggling, there's things that you can do completely naturally to regulate your child's sleep-wake system and have them produce their own melatonin naturally. On top of that, it's really important that parents are the leaders when it comes to sleep and modeling sleep. If your child doesn't see you as a leader, melatonin or not, you're probably seeing behavior problems everywhere in your day. Talk to your doctor. Melatonin may not be safe for your child.